Good morning everybody, Gina here. I'm in my kitchen and I wanna share with you a tip to help you get in your water. So how's everybody doing? Day three and it is time to get in your three quarter gallon, hi Nicole, hi Sunny, um, <clears throat> your three quarters of a gallon of water, uh, three quarters to a gallon, I aim for a gallon. Look, I'm already like really deep into my gallon today. So this is how I measure my water. I use this as my gallon. Hi everyone. Um, hi Jess, Mwah, to Vegas, all my Vegas, I love my Vegas peeps. So, hi Candy, hi everyone. So here's the magnificent gallon of water. I get through this every single day, yes. I really try hard to get in my water because here's a little pointer. So water is so important. It is like key, right? I told you some people think, oh, this is so silly. Water, why is she doing this water challenge? Because, hi UK, I love it. Everyone from everywhere. Um, it's so important, okay? It helps shuttle the nutrients. It helps excrete all the toxins. It helps clear up your skin. It helps, hi Liz, it helps with so many different things. Hormonal balance, I could go on and on and on. And all you have to do is be proactive and get in your water. But it's so easy to forget. And also, it can be kind of a little bit of a pain in the butt when you're running to the bathroom all the time, right? So I know that's been a common topic that everyone's like, okay, I'm peeing every five minutes. I'm running to the bathroom. This is ridiculous. See it as a good sign. Oh, hi, Beverly. Um, see it as a really good sign because that means that you're cleansing your body. And what's go if your pee is not bright yellow, unless you've taken multivitamins, often that can turn your pee really bright yellow or orange. It's a good sign to have it clear. So if you know, I put essential oils in my water, lemon oil, and it's great flavoring and awesome for cleansing. Love it. So here's my little tip today. We're on the same page. So let's get into this tip, okay? So we, water, I, it's so boring and bland. I'm not going to, I'm not going to lie about that. It really is. So I can get in a little bit and unless I force myself, it's really hard. So it's important that I want you, um, flavor my water. So here's a really simple tip to flavor your water. I talked about yesterday, I drink, um, put lemon in my water first thing upon waking before I acidify my system because I'm a coffee lover. I'm not going to deny that. I do put lemon in my water to alkalize my system. It's really important that we try to alkalize our system because disease and all the bad stuff grows in acidic environments. So alkalinity is very important. So I use lemon to, um, flavor my waters. Okay. So this is one of the ways. So I'm giving you a little tip. Um, another little pointer, Italy, hi, ciao, my Italian heritage, I love you. Um, so I, I only have one kidney. Did you guys know that? So I only have one kidney. So not only is it really important for water intake, for me especially, because I have to keep my, my kidneys, my kidneys healthy and cleansing because I, you can only, you can't live without a kidney and I only have one. Most people have two. So it's just born that way. So water has been really important to me my whole life and that's probably why I've gotten really good about it. So here's the deal. I'm going to use this nifty little lemon um, juicer because you know when you squeeze lemon, it gets everywhere. So I'm going to use this. It'll, it'll not only juice this lemon, but it's going to keep the seeds so I don't get the seeds. So I'm going to use this to put into my gallon. Let's see if I can do this on camera. So I'm balancing this. I'm hoping that it's not going to fall. Um, and then where did I put my funnel? Uh, I hate it when funnels go missing. I just had a funnel. Um, funnel, 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 hold on, stand by. Here it is, <laughs> I didn't take it out. Okay, so here's the funnel. I'm gonna use a funnel so that I get everything in the gallon and not all over my face. So I'm just gonna use the funnel. I use this all the time, to be honest with you. I use funnels all the time. So let me just put this here because I don't trust that it's gonna balance on the counter. So heading into work, oh my God, one kidney, two babies, a champion. Thank you very much. Yeah, one kidney, kind of crazy, huh? So I'm gonna put my lemon in here, face down, butt up, face down, butt up, and then I'm going to just squeeze this puppy into my water. So here we go, I'm gonna squeeze it. Here's my workout of the day too, right? <laughs> I'm not kidding. Um, so, okay, so here we go. So squeezing my lemon juice into my water, and I know most of you probably have already caught on to this trick, but the more important part of this trick is how I'm doing it. I'm using the funnel so it all goes in and not all over my face. I'm using this squeezer so I get all the juice out because when you don't use this, you waste so much of the lemon. 
And then I'm also not getting the seeds. So I use this thing all the time. So this is the lemon squeezer. Use it for limes, um, but love it for lemons. So there we go. Okay, there was my workout for the day. And there you have it. So now I've got my lemon in my gallon. Shake it up. Use this to measure so I know where I'm at for the day. And as you can see, I'm doing pretty good, right? Because it's only 9.15 in the morning. And I'm like three quarters, or one quarter of the gallon down, three quarters to go. And then I take my nifty little, yeah, lemon oil. I actually have lemon oil. I have that exact one. I use it. I use a diffuser all the time in my kitchen. I love essential oils. Um, then I'm just going to pour this into here. Bam, there you have it. So this is how I keep track. This is how I actually drink it. And there you go. So such a simple tip, right? So I hope that you give that a try. It just kind of helps flavor your water. So I have all kinds of tricks, but um, that's just one of them. And Dandy Blend. Oh, you asked about Dandy Blend. So I get mine online, and um, I wish I had, let me show you how I have it. I wish I had the bag to show you, but I don't. I just, I, I'm so obsessed with containers, glass containers. So I like put everything in glass containers, my oatmeal, my Dandy Blend, everything. So um, I have, this is Dandy Blend. Doesn't it look like coffee? So it's instant coffee. It's instant imitation coffee. Comes like this. I actually need to write on there, Dandy Blend. Um, yeah, so you can get it online. I get it online or some... Um, some high end or like some mom and pop stores might carry it. You won't really find it at your normal grocery store, but um, definitely online. Get everything online because I'm a busy mom, so I don't like to travel. Well, I like to travel, but it's not very realistic for me anymore. So yeah, hopefully that helps. Look it up. Dandy Blend. All right. Do I know Jen Hendershot? Of course I know Jen. She's amazing. Yeah, I was when I was competing, Jen was competing. She's a rock star. Gosh, she's talented. So that is my tip for the day. I hope it helps you guys. And let's see if I have anything else to share with you. Oh, yes, I do. So we are getting really, really, really close to launching Devotion. We have so much in store for you guys. Here's the deal. So we've announced that we have protein powder, right? We have our uh, brownie batter. Everybody knows about that. Look at my containers. I don't even have the containers yet. This is my brownie batter. This is how I'm keeping it. <laughs> Isn't this amazing? Hold the questions for a second. So this is the brownie batter. Look at this deliciousness, right? It's in my container. I don't even have like the real deal yet. And next, here's the angel food. See, I'm like loving my jars. Here's the angel food. So this is, this is it. It's amazing. But we have yet to reveal what else we have in store for you all. It is like the main products. But here's the deal. For those of you that are watching the Periscope, go to our website, devotionnutrition.com. So that's devotionnutrition.com. Sign up for our newsletter, and you're going to get information on our products and the other product line that we have yet to reveal, but you guys are going to be first up to find out. So exciting. So make sure you go to devotionnutrition.com. Sign up, enter your email, and you're going to have to confirm your email address, and then you're going to get another email sent to you that's going to have more information on our protein and the other products that we're launching with. Little secret for you guys, for those of you that are following, you guys can go do that right now and sign up and find out what we have in store. It's going to be a complete game changer. We are so excited, so definitely check that out, okay? So Devotion Nutrition to find out what's in store. We haven't announced the other product, but you guys are going to find out when you enter your email. And yeah, so drink up today. Challenge day number three. If you go into the bathroom, it's a good sign. So I know it's kind of annoying, but it's a great sign. And how do you, okay, here's the question that I'm going to end with. Um, how do you lean out your arms? Okay, I wish I could tell you that doing tricep dips or bicep curls or doing all, you know, all your arm exercises are going to stimulate and change the look and feel of your arms. But the truth is, there's no way to 
specifically train a certain area. If there was, I would have no fat on my booty and it would be exactly the way I want it because I would just train that specific way to make my butt even better, right? So here's the deal. You cannot spot reduce. I really wish you could, but that's the truth. No stop, spot reduction. The answer is going to be working out and clean eating. It's really that simple. It's clean eating. Check out my plans if you need some help with your clean eating. It's working out, so it's doing circuit workouts or training, like isolated, depending on your goals and also what resonates best with you. For me, I love the circuit workouts. So it's going to be a mix of those two and getting in your water, getting in your proper supplementation, and keeping a healthy mind, a positive mindset. There really is no other answer. I'm sorry, I wish I could say, okay, go do 100 tricep dips every single day and you're gonna get amazing arms. But the truth is, it's a complete whole package. So once you have all the pieces of the puzzle and you put them together, you can have incredible arms too. So that's the answer, I'm signing off. Thank you all for joining me this morning or this afternoon, whatever time it is where you are, and um, I will see you guys soon. Have an amazing day. Don't forget to sign up and find out what the other products are. DevotionNutrition.com. Join our newsletter. It's going to be incredible. Incredible. I can't even explain it to you. I've been able to experiment with this stuff for like a year now. And it's been so hard to not tell everyone all about it. But now that we're weeks away, we are letting people know what it is so that you can get excited too because it's going to change your whole lifestyle. It's going to change how you eat. It's going to change and make food fun, exciting, and flexible. So make sure you sign up and find out. And um, I'm going to check in with you guys tomorrow. See you guys later. Have a great day. Mwah.